yes. Hey, <laughs> thou hast been smitten. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> I've prepared this time. <laughs> hey, no, no, I'm shining. It's just me now and Alan. Stay out of it. This is going to be interesting when there's bases actually set up and people have to defend their bases. What are you doing? Get away from me. something fun. Stand still. No, I'm trying to get revenge here. <laughs> it's annoying. Hey, this is pretty fun. Yeah. Do you have a system? Jeez, jeez, run away, oh my gosh. Oh my, you're gonna kill me. <laughs> this is too much fun. This is more fun than it should, more fun than it should be, I should say. <laughs> more fun than a pillow fight. Yeah. Alright, welcome everyone to our new faction. <laughs> Astro. So, <laughs> thank you, thank okay. you. When you first join, <laughs> you can obviously see the message above there. Um, common commands would be slash F for the faction commands, shop for the shop, Ben for the bending abilities, and then wild to get started out in the wild. So I have to actually jump down there to start this? Um, let's stay up here first. Um, so over this way real quick is the player stats and uh, a mop grinder. So we'll head to the mop grinder first over here. Uh -huh. um, we have a mop grinder. So I've been told this is pretty typical for factions to have a mob grinder. So you can just kill stuff and... Get food and experience, I believe. Yep. I don't know, yeah. Okay. Murder pit. I like it. Pretty much. Pretty much. Animal cruelty uh. pit. I like it. <laughs> so, Are we going to get flagged by PETA? Not again. Uh, the leaderboard over here. Statistics. Um, right now we have three leaderboards going. We'll add more as the Man, what game a, mode opens up. What a great design. Yeah. Um, so we have kills, we have top balance, and then we have MCMMO power. Woo! I love this scarecrow. Yeah. All right, so over this way, back this way. And to get back to spawn, you just do slash spawn, just saying. Crates. Um, yep, crates this way. And this we all crate? have three different crate types. And currently, we are these are the same types of crates on our Skyblock server. Um, so we have the common crate, rare crate, and mythic crate. Uh, mythic being the best. Oh, I can't. Rare do being it. the second. If you common jump and you do it, it's nice little parachute. Kickback, yeah. <laughs> um, so whenever one joins, they should spawn with a one common crate key, so they can come over here right away and open up a common crate key. Oh. And you right click to open it. Left click to preview the chest. Okay. Um, okay, so now we go back to spawn and can jump down. Okay. I'm going to jump, jump down. Woohoo! Oh, no, don't die. And when you're, at, when you're on spawn, there's no fall damage, so don't worry about dying. Oh, uh, okay. Um, so as you walk in here, this is our bending hub area. Oh, shoot. And for those who don't know, the bending's based on the last airbender and uh, Korra, The Legend of Korra, uh, TV show slash cartoon on Nickelodeon. Um, for those who haven't seen it, it's based around elements. So <laughs> same thing in Minecraft. There's f technically four different elements with also a chi element of sorts. Um, so you have your typical air bending, water bending, uh, earth bending, fire bending, and then your chi blocking masters. Uh, so when you first start, huh. you can go to the config or the compass, or sl do slash GUI to get the compass again, and you'll select your element that you want to choose at first. And don't worry, you'll be able to change your element as well um, as you play. Okay. If you look over here, Alan. This guy, the avatar guy, he will be the NPC you talk to to change your element. So if you right click him, the piece of paper will kind of give you information on it. As you can see, there's different um, holograms to the each location area. So you have your air, water, 
and all the other elements. So we'll start with air over here, I suppose. So you got to start at level one for all the elements, really. And mm -hmm. this is pretty generalized for all the elements. So level one, you have different spell books you can buy. So if you right click level one, you can see the different spells and the cost for them. So Air scooter uh, is a right. is a move, and then all these are moves too. Right. So you start it. with three different moves, um, and then you have to, through an RPG element, kind of level up your skills and your element that you've chosen. Um, and then you have to. So how it works, you have to unlock all the level ones to progress to level two, unlock all okay. the level two to progress to level three, and then level four. Okay. And there's four different levels for each element except chi. Chi has three. Because there's not as many spells for chi. And obviously the spells get better and stronger the higher level it is. So, oh, for example, water bending has your pretty typical spells for level one. And then when you get to level four, it actually has blood bending, which allows you to basically control people for a certain amount of time. Ooh. And make them go, make them go flying, <laughs> pick them up, and throw them across the map. Oh, that's that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, that can get pretty fun. <laughs> okay, can we try out some spells? Should I buy some? Sure. Okay, let's try this. Confirm cost of mm -hmm. thousand. So there's okay. a confirmation. Yep. So I've learned Earth Armor. Can I try it out here? Or do I have to go somewhere? Um, since we're OP, we can do it at spawn, but people who are players will have to do it outside of spawn, so you might as well do it outside of spawn. Like Ren. When you, okay, cool. Yeah, when you get outside of spawn, oh, wow, this you're is beautiful. leaving the safe zone, so this is technically the war zone, and you won't yeah. be able to build or move or destroy blocks in the war zone. The war zone's meant for, like, PvP exclusive and... Um, this is where the actual Envoy event will spawn, so crates will drop in at random points throughout the war zone, and we, you guys fight over them for the rewards and search for them. Okay, so now I and have after... to bind the spell somehow, right? Yeah, so open up your menu. Okay, I have a bunch of stuff here already. How do you? Um, I just bought Earth Armor. I just click it and then I bind it to my slot, I guess. Bind it, so the like the the black glass panes yeah. are your slots. So go ahead and click one you want to bind it to. I prefer to bind them to slots that are empty. Yeah. But in most cases you'll be able to bind to uh, slots that have items in it as well. Right. So I probably want to take this. Oops. Take earth armor and stick it there, and then we try it out. By right you might want to do PKH. Yeah, I'll f just figure out. How that's to do the it. best way that's going to learn how to do spells is doing P slash PKH yeah. and then the spell name without its spaces. Oh, I have to like be looking at Earth. Yeah. And then I tap sneak. Whoa! Now I have so Earth armor. It looks like it gave you some leather armor. Yeah. Because this thing is shooting me. Oh, and it hurts. But it I hurts. did have some armor. Yes. Before. Can... So it looks like there's, it lasts for a certain duration. Yeah, so I'll have sneak. And then, whoop, now I have some armor that follows me around. Yay. Oop. Okay, that's... As an earthbender, you can also use it with metal. Mm. And get iron. No armor. Iron armor. I'm going to try catapult. Whoa, holy crap, that's cool. <laughs> Did you take fall damage? Um, no, but I'm getting shot, I think. I got yeah. you. Definitely getting shot. Let's see if I can... So yeah, there's a lot of fun... The... Yeah, no fall damage, that's weird. That's cool. Creepers, yep. And then um, I'm just going to find some more earth shard which is i'm gonna pick up multiple chunks and hurl them towards the target okay let's see if i can do that against some mobs okay where are the mobs hey buddy 
Oh, come on. I want to kill this thing. Pew, 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 pew. Oh, this thing is killing me. Oh, you got him. Yay. <laughs> Advanced fishing. <laughs> Earth fishing. Yes. That's basically it for spawn. Okay. But one other cool thing is the airbender right here. Oh, yeah, right here. If you just walk up to him. Oh my gosh. He'll send you back to spawn. Oh, interesting. That's long distance. I want to do that yes. again. <laughs> yes. It's kind of fun. Hey, buddy. I'm just like, you know, trespassing on your territory. That's all. Oh! That's so cool. Um, so yeah, getting into the factions portion, it's your pretty typical faction setup. You know, you can set your factions, join factions, uh, you know, leave factions, um, set your allies and then your enemies. So it's your pretty typical faction server. Okay, yeah. I've never played factions, you just do... but everyone else probably has. Yeah, hopefully. I mean, you just do slash F and it'll show you all the commands that you can do. Uh-huh. And this server is completely grief friendly, PvP friendly, raiding, all the above. So go out there and ruin people's builds, I guess. Great. <laughs> awesome. That's what faction's all about, I suppose. Yes, griefing is good. Um, in the future, we're playing like tournament tech battles. So we'll have PvP zones in certain times where we have tournaments set up and certain rewards, probably. Um, kind of like show, we have different um, battles with elements. Okay. Other than that, that is pretty much all that's need to be covered oh that's it huh yep pretty much okay um oh one thing last i want to mention is okay so once you buy it it's yours even if you switch elements correct you just won't be able to use it unless you're that element that's associated with it okay all right I made a faction, now I'm going to build a Death Star in the middle of the sky. No, nope. please don't team. start building <laughs> until the game mode opens up. I'm announcing my plans for anyone that wants to join me in conquering. There's no recruiting in this video. <laughs> i just merely saying the obvious that given that this video is going to be released soon, I might as well let everyone know which faction is going to be the clear victor here. <laughs> okay guys, so I guess enjoy this new faction server and go crazy and grief each other and just be nice to each other though and, uh, <laughs> in the nicest way possible exactly and uh, enjoy this airbending guy and we also wanted to advertise our discord server a lot of people don't know about it but factions enjoy and see you guys in the next video until next time <laughs> uh, what, what?